I'm gonna mix an entire song using only vocal presets. Okay, so I'm using Logic, but the process is the same no matter what software you're using. I got four basic tracks, intro, verse, hook, and ad-libs. Let's go in and break it down. I'm going to listen to each, what it sounds like without a vocal preset, and then I'm gonna apply one, and by the end of this, we're gonna have a fully mixed song. Here we go. Back and forth, bite my tongue. All right, so this one, I kinda want more of an ad-lib feel and I want it to be spacey. So I'm gonna go into my user patches. I'm gonna pick one from the Vocal Drip 2 bundle and it's gonna be a bonus vocal preset. I already know which one I want. It's gonna be Heaven Sent, okay? I'm going to change the key to the right key, which is B major. This song's in B major. I'm gonna turn it on and here we go. Already so good, here we go. All right, that ad lib. I want it to be more crispy. The nice thing about my Vocal Drip 2 bundle is that it comes with these knobs that you can tweak it. I'll show you. Uh, so the bonus, I'm what, yeah, so the crisp lib I think is gonna be perfect. I'm gonna change the key to B major. And let's hear what it sounds like. That's so good, perfect. All right, so I want it to be a little more reverby. I want it to be a little less bright. I want more echo and a little more phase. And then I think I'm gonna turn it down overall. Let's hear what it sounds like again. Here we go. Let's do the verse. All right. A little rough, but here we go. We're going to apply. My voice is very similar to Justin Bieber, so I'm going to go through my artist presets, and I'm going to pick the Justin Bieber vocal preset. And again, I'm going to make sure to change the key to B major, which it already is. Perfect. So let's hear what we got. Yeah, you fuss and fighting over every little detail. So when you got problems, you go fix them up with retail. Alright, awesome. So now I'm gonna move on to the hook. So for the hook, I want something a little more powerful, a little a little more wide. Um, so I'm gonna go back to my vocal drip 2 bundle and I'm gonna go to lead vocal presets and let's just go through them and see what we got here. I'm going to make sure to change the key for each one. I'm gonna change the key. That's too much. Viral vocal, let's see what this is. B major. That's nice, but it's a little too clean for me. Alright, let's try crispy clean. That one sounds fire to me. Alright, perfect. I think I'm gonna increase the chorus effect. Turn up the reverb. A little more volume. A little more air. Fire. Perfect. And the song's basically done. That's all the tracks. The whole time I've had a mastering preset on it, so here's what it's like without the mastering preset. Without and with. So there you go. That's how easy it is to mix a song from start to finish using only vocal presets. I recommend having more than one vocal preset because you're going to be making so many different types of songs and each song needs a different preset. So start to curate your vocal preset collection so that you can create the perfect song every time. It really does work. It's the future of music and I hope you guys cop one. Go to riseupaudio.com and start sounding professional today. Peace.